Welcome back to Brightside. In about three hours, SpaceX will launch a Falcon Heavy rocket for the first time in more than three years. It is a sight to behold, right? That rocket will launch a mission for the U.S. Space Force. This after the launch, not one, but two side boosters will come in for a landing. Now, you may hear a sonic boom if you're on the east side of the state. The launch is set for 940 this morning from Kennedy Space Center. You got some notes there, sir. Yeah, I was looking at, you know, Falcon Heavy is it's, it's essentially three of the Falcon 9 rockets strapped together. So you have the one core stage in the middle, you have two more of the Falcon Heavy typical, or not, sorry, Falcon 9 rockets on the side of it. Right, making So it this heavy. thing is, right, exactly. <laughs> yeah, so um, this is the same one that launched, remember the Tesla they launched? Uh, I think it was 2018, and that was the big deal. They yeah. launched the Tesla up there, and they had had a, a, you know, a mannequin inside of the Tesla. So this is the same rocket that did that. Um, not as big as the SLS, uh, the Artemis rocket that will be launching later this month. There are just a couple of numbers here. So Falcon Heavy, 230 feet tall. The SLS, or that um, Artemis rocket, is 322 feet tall. So Artemis is much bigger than yeah. Falcon Heavy. So when you Gives see you Falcon Heavy go up later today, um, just know that Artemis is um, it's huge. Even bigger. Yes, and I was out there in the 2018 launch, and when Falcon Heavy goes up, I mean, you can feel the ripping of the rocket as it goes up into space. It's an incredible thing to see. So if you are heading out to Cape Canaveral later on this morning, maybe you're getting up right now, you're heading out towards the East Coast to try to catch the launch. First of all, weather conditions look pretty good. There are going to be a couple of scattered cumulus clouds around the area, so that's always a little bit of a concern for the uh, space, launch, space launch officers. But overall, it looks like a good morning to launch a rocket. Temperatures will be in the low to middle 80s as we head towards launch time at 940 this morning. There's a 90% chance for go weather conditions. Again, that launch at 940. Now, I will say there is some low cloud cover between here and the Space Coast, so we'll hopefully be able to get that out of here before launch. But if it doesn't, then obviously it's going to be hard to see. But if we get clearing skies, we should be able to see Falcon Heavy from over here on the Gulf Coast.